Everyone's here? Good. I'm Jane Kirkland, Director of the Neural Investigation Unit. This is Sarah Barnes, our Biotech and Forensic Analyst. Nice to meet you. Ruth Halliday, our Chief Technology Expert. Hey there. Unfortunately, there's no time to get to know each other better right now. The young boy's life is at stake, and he's counting on us. I'd like you to see some footage that was taken from a press briefing this morning. Take a look over here at your hollow board. Hamish, this one's personal. Get it done. We'd better get started. Patience is not the director's strong suit. Our technology will let you examine Lucas's recent memories. Once you're in, focus on finding clues. Go for any information that might aid us in narrowing in on Lucas's location. Take a look over here. Ruth set up this interactive map. We'll be able to set the filters on top to narrow in on Lucas's location. I've also added the filters here on your objective board, so you can reference them while in the memory. Your current goal is also outlined. I'll update it as you make progress in the investigation. You may want to take notes during your investigation. I suggest you equip yourself with a notepad and pen, just in case. Ready? Good. Reloading Lucas's most recent memory in three, two, one. Move your cursor over objects that look interesting. If they highlight, there may be more you can do with them. Whenever you look at an interesting detail on an object, I'll highlight and label it. You can air tap while looking at a piece of evidence to help with the investigation. I'll update the objective board when you examine evidence. I've just updated your objectives board with the evidence Providence has detected in the memory, including what you've already examined. If you ever feel lost, just look at the board. It's a good way to know if you've missed anything that could help you figure things out. 